King Koppel Rose Bay School of the Sacred Heart is one of the most imposing and significant buildings on the shores of Sydney Harbour. Originally a private home called Claremont, built in 1851, this magnificent heritage listed property became the home of the Convent of the Sacred Heart in 1882. So, in 2017, when it was realised the main building water tower was deteriorating and in disrepair, the decision was made to restore it to its original glory. Zinc cladding was not the original design. From archival photos, it was found the original roofing from the 19th century was in fact slate and lead. The slate was a specific type called Welsh Penryn, considered the finest slate in the world. The decision was made to honour the heritage nature of the building and despite the challenges, make the restoration absolutely perfect. Fortunately for King Coppel Rose Bay, there was a Sydney-based company that specialised in slate roofing, with its entire team trained in traditional slate roofing techniques from the UK. First class slate roofing had the skills, the equipment and above all, good supplies of the highly prized Welsh Penryn slate required for the restoration. The first stage of restoration was to remove the zinc cladding and this revealed a strong hardwood base structure. Onto this was placed breathable Proctor roof sarking and new Oregon battens. Expertly measured and hand cut with imported tools, the slate was attached using traditional copper clouts and nails. Copper is traditional because it doesn't rust or deteriorate. Copper fixings will last the lifetime of the slate, almost 200 years. First class slate roofing then created all the ridge capping and sills in imported Midland English lead, hand shaped and soldered on site. The beautiful finial was removed to the first class slate factory, where it was cleaned, hand shaped and soldered. When brought back to site, although 150 years old, it appeared new again. In total, 35 kilograms of lead was used in this restoration. Underneath the water tower roof, behind the cedar doors and hinges, revealed posts and sills with serious rot. New Oregon timbers were precisely shaped and cut into the posts and sills to replace the rotten sections. More Midland English lead was then used, handcrafted to cap the sills with a perfect watertight seal. And even further below that section, the original sandstone facade was completely restored, using no harsh chemicals and a mortar mix true to the original building specifications. There could be no mistakes with this impressive restoration and the result was perfect. The magnificent water tower remains the stunning focal point of a building that means so much to so many people. And by treating the restoration of this original building with respect and complete attention to historical detail, King Koppel Rose Bay remains true to its values as it continues to nurture, educate and develop generations of fine young women for over 135 years.